All right, so you know what I think? I think I kind of just mucked things up by going... Um, like, by going from a free flight mission and then, like, jumping over to, like, a, a, th a thing. I think that, uh, like, gave it a bad setup. But I've been looking things up a bit in the meantime. Like, <clears throat> I have already taken a bit of time between these sessions to sort of, like, look at how people are playing this. And one thing that I've noticed, that, like, not, not everyone knows this yet, okay? Not everyone knows this yet. See this? You can just get into your railjack right here from your orbiter. Boom. I'm in my railjack. So now it's gonna be my railjack that's gonna... That's gonna, that's gonna, like, take off. If I just go from here. But we can't do that yet, people. Nah, no, no. We can't do that yet. You know why? Because I have not given my railjack a name. And we can't actually take flight without having a name for our railjack. One that hopefully... Hopefully, will soon be prominently uh, displayed in game somehow. Because currently, um, like the problem with the railjacks is like there's always almost no way for like your teammates to to see the name. But, but in case they change that, this will be. The, uh, what you call it? Uh, HSS? HMS? I don't know what that's like. HMS, like that's Her uh, her Majesty's or something. That's British. I don't know what the, the Swedish one is. So for now, we're just going to call this... The Manual Breathing. Because <laughs> that's, that's, that's going to be fun. I like it. Yeah. <gasps> oh man, I can, oh I can re 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 my colors, re recolorify my my insides. Oh I like it. Oh everyone's gonna get to to step into such a neato ship here. Wow. Wow, that's 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 nice. Okay, what do we want for a ship? Do we want like a nice pink? Yeah, we like that. Ooh, and secondary colors. Oh, wow. Ooh, maybe just a pure white. Ooh, that's that's sexy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, and then we have our, our turts. Our tertiary colors. Ah, oh, what, what are we gonna do here? I'm gonna fiddle with this for like hours later. But like, I like a nice, a nice, a nice purple here. You can get your accents colors. Ooh, that's your floor. Do you want some dark floors, maybe? Maybe. Maybe you want some dark floors. Ooh. I can go for like something dark almost, yeah, burgundy, yeah, mmm, ooh, and then we got the lighting, what, what, what's the color of our lighting, come on, come on, show me some, oh, so that's like the screens and stuff, ooh, okay, I like that too, I want some, some hard neon colors here, yeah, yeah, I like that, yeah, that's great, All right, we got a ship. I'm gonna, I'm gonna invest so goddamn hard in this thing. Watch me spend like all the plat on reskinning this and everything. Man, who knows? Meditation. That which can be destroyed by the truth should be. So, uh, what I've learned, and we'll talk about this when I play the missions. First of all, what I've learned is that right now, when you just start out. Uh, your railjack is is shit. It sucks. The guns ain't doing nothing. Guns ain't doing no goddamn damage at all. But um, but that's gonna get better with time. I've also learned that th this thing has a <laughs> a grind that can only be described as massive. Even going so far as having like RNG on um, on the effects of items in the drops. 
or like you can get better or worse versions of like just upgrades for this thing if you're unlucky. So you just gotta grind for the parts and then it's like, oh shit, I got a bad roll. Oof. Um, so there's that. But that's fine. That's fine. That's the name of this game since day one anyway. I've also learned that there is something you have to do at the end of every mission. People are saying this has to be a bug. And that is all the stuff that you pick up along the way. You gotta you gotta refine that down in the foundry before you end the mission. Uh, if you don't, then well, tough shit. You're not gonna get to keep it. Looks like the Grenier are feeling Ooh. lucky. Good hunting. You oh dear. See that? Use this to extinguish fires, seal whole breaches, and for a fast recall to the rail jack. Bogies on scope. Good hunting. Well, thank you. So I guess I should move. Um, yeah. We have company. Bring your cruise ship on scope. So I don't know. Single person attack craft. Prepare to engage. See that? I'm picking stuff up as I'm like firing at stuff and whatnot. And that's all fine. But if I forget to uh, refine. Oh, ah, there we go. Now people are joining the squads. Alright. So, so far, so good, I think. Now, I'm gonna unpilot the ship, cause, cause, like, I don't know. Yeah, this guy's just here. I don't know if he is gonna, like, do what needs to be done. Oi. Oi. Nah, he's doing what needs to be done. That's great! Okay, I got a, I got a crew. So, are they doing that? No, he exited the railjack. I don't... Yeah, I don't think anyone is repairing shit. So you gotta put on your Omni tool. Oh, is he? Okay, he is. Ah. Okay, good. I'll go back. Uh, I just needed to make sure that someone was in fact repairing shit. Now that I know that that's... So here's another icky thing. And that is, like, Tenno or... Yeah, I can't actually hurt the cruise ship. Uh, another guy has to do that. Like, I can shoot at it, but I can't actually destroy it. No, but the problem here is that, like, um, like you have shared loot in these missions, right? You have shared loot uh, in regard to to ev anything like that I um, uh, shoot down or like just run into here. But things that like the away team are doing when you leave the railjack and stuff and collect when you're outside there. There we go. <laughs> like, I just have to to trust that my team is doing what they're supposed to be doing. Because... Um, I can't keep track of that while I'm piloting. Electrical hazards must be contained. 
Oh boy. Well, we have a guy who said that he was on repair duty. So I'm gonna trust that he is. Shields energizing. Good work. Veneer interceptors alerted. Contact imminent. Good luck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. What happened? Like, what happened? Oh dear. What happened? This is like bugged. I'm not... Okay. Ah, there we go. Okay, <laughs> I don't know what happened there. And I've lost my uh, my targeting reticule. Okay, all that's left is to take out some fighters. We can do that. But can we do that without our targeting reticule? I mean, I'll try. Don't worry, people. This is just out. There's gonna be, uh... Ah, it's very hard to target without having the reticule. No. Enemy fighters are routing. Enemy infrastructure neutralized. So Body check this out. As complete. Here's what you gotta do. This is very important once you finish your mission. Before you go home, you have to, have to, have to, Go down here to the foundry. All integrity alert. All and refine. All sealed. Good job. Okay. And if you don't do that, you don't get to keep the goddamn materials. Oh, there's still people here shooting at us. Hmm. Oh god. Yeah, so something has bugged out. Ah, and I want to return to my dojo. But it, I'm not sure it, it doesn't tell me that I can. Let's see if this works. <laughs> Woo, that was lucky. Yeah, so that's the problem. Uh, if you refine, then you can't use those materials to uh, build stuff in the mission. So if you still need to repair stuff, then you can't refine. But if you don't refine, then you don't get all of these things. Now this is my dojo, so I think I can exit. I don't think anyone else inside the, the railjack can exit, because they haven't been invited to my dojo. I'm sorry. <laughs> what? What happened? Who's shooting at me? Is that like still someone in the mission shooting at me? Wow. All right. <laughs> yeah, this is... Mm. I don't even know what happened there. That's not supposed to happen. That's buggy. That's buggy as hell. But we got a bunch of stuff here. We got 
Acrox capacitors. We got one intrinsic. We got some ferrite. Got some some stuff. Okay. All these. All these are new. And I don't even know what these are. I don't even know what any of this is. It's all new. Um, but yeah, there's like... Obviously some things that need to be... Um, Meditation. The opposite of a small truth is a lie. The opposite of a great truth is another great truth. Hmm. Um, there are some kinks. There are some kinks that need to be worked out in this thing. There's an argument that maybe they pushed it out a bit earlier than they should just to have it in time for the game awards. And it's like not exact. Everything's not exactly ready yet. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know about any of this. No. But. But yeah. As you can see, like when you are piloting the ship, you can't really pay attention to the rest of the crew. You just gotta have to trust that everyone is doing what they're supposed to be doing. Um, so, and the away team, they have to go out and, and destroy the cruise ships. Like, they gotta do it. And if they don't do it, well, I can't do any of it. I can't hurt it from the, from the pilot's position. There is, like, the big cannon underneath, but I haven't unlocked that yet, so I can't use that yet. No, but the problem is, like, if the away team ditch, the, like, fly out in arcwing mode, take out a cruise ship, take out, like, a galleon with a commander or something, and, like, ooh, the, the, the galleon commander inside of it, like, drops, like, a weapon blueprint or whatever, then only the guy who's in arcwing mode who flew away from the rail deck is gonna get that. The people who stayed inside, the guy running around doing repairs, or me piloting the ship and shooting stuff, we're not gonna get that blueprint. That's why currently everyone wants to be on the away team, everyone wants to jump out of the arc wing and just fly around. Because you get more resources, and you get less shit. Um, oh, look at that! I have uh, clan members who are starting to um, uh, research stuff, it seems. Thank you, thank you, Vaklov, for starting this. I guess this is for everyone in the clan. Wow, okay. Alright. So, better auto cannons. Gotcha. There's more research we could start, if we want to. Uh, a toxin cannon, sure. Alright. Uh, I'll leave that be for now. Now, I'm wondering. Here, we only have like this, right? Yeah, yeah. Armament, got the Pulsar. I like the Pulsar, actually. The Apox, I don't know. Uh, seem to be doing seem to be doing good. Now, with the avionics, I found a bunch of stuff that I don't know what it is that I found. Okay. What? Oh, are these the things we found? Like, Hull Weave, Last Stand? I think so. Max Armor. Increase all turret damage by 19% when hull is below 20%. Huh, okay, what do I have? More hull, more turret damage. More armor. So this is max armor by 7%. But this... Yeah, that's max armor by, by 14%. So I got some more armor here. Can I put on more stuff? No, because I already used that. But I can put on last stand. Because I found that. Okay. Oh, and this is just my avionics capacity. What about tactical? I haven't found anything yet here. What about battle? I haven't found anything yet here. Okay. Gotcha. I can craft some stuff already, it seems. If I want to. Battle avionics. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can craft that with some of my Copernics. Munitions. Well, I, I can't use that yet because I don't have the gunnery. But maybe someone else can join my crew who does have that gunnery and can use it. Dome chargers, forward artillery. Yeah, same here. Okay. And we definitely need to make a uh, Revolite. So that we can power our repair tools. And now we have intrinsics. I, I found one, right? Yeah, one intrinsic available. 
So I can increase my tactical. Get that up. Uh, improved tactical avionics. Arc wing catapult maneuvers and powerful tactical deployment abilities. So here's my avionics. I have battle, tactical, and integrated. I don't have any tactical yet, so improving my tacticals doesn't seem very Im impressive. Uh, advanced speed and more maneuvering. Okay. Improved gunnery. Uh, I like gunnery because I want to use the big cannon. And then engineering. Bolster resource yields. I mean, it's just... Here we see. Okay. Better, better, faster repairs. Forge flux energy in real time. Rank 3. Replenish combat ordnance. Rank 4. Increase force, force yields. Um... Uh, so here's a bit bonk. You have to be rank 9 to start getting more stuff in refinement. But by the time you're rank 9, you've already gotten like millions of stuffs. So I'm not sure if that's going to be like important. Uh, ordnance, target lead indicators and ordnance lock on. Yes, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I See that? I am now a number 1. I am a number one gunnery. And there's apparently a new uh, another thing here, command, and I'm gonna guess, this this doesn't exist yet. I'm gonna guess command might be uh, to have an NPC crew. Because I have heard hints that there's an idea, there's an idea that you're gonna be able to uh, use your Kuvalich as an NPC crew member on your railjack and that people that sounds goddamn fantastic to me so now that we did this um we unlocked some more missions now we can do this one in the ryan belt that's level 17 to 20 or this one in the fangul satellites uh, that's level 20 to 28. So we're gonna do this, like, just... We're gonna move up in the world slowly. In fact, I'm gonna say that, like, with the grind... With the grind involved here... Like, I don't even know if, if this one is gonna be, like, feasible. 